Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We are back on the Wumpa Islands, and we are about to approach the high road. Uh, in this episode here, depending on how much uh, how much trouble I have, we may be finishing the first crash game here, which is why it becomes all the more important that uh, in the comments, you guys let me know. Do do you want to see me just going on to crash? Oh, jeepers. I want to go back there. Um, do you want to see uh, me going through these levels again, going in and going for the box crystal? I gotta just understand that there's a second one I can jump off of. There we go. And that was the second one. Cool. Great. Not gonna do it anymore. Just, just not gonna do it anymore. Um, but yeah, do you guys want to see me go for, like, box time crystals in this one? Do you want me to just say heck with it and go on to the second game so you get to take a look and see what more of these levels are looking like? Uh, yeah, let me know. Oh, goodness. Right on the, the tippy corner of that thingermajig. That panel... Uh, the board. There we go. That's the word I'm looking for. Board. God damn it. But yeah, it's been a hot minute since. We've been doing a lot of the ranked Pokemon videos, and then I've been editing Phil's Emerald stream for the channel to be archived there. So we, uh, we haven't had Crash in a minute. Just felt like having a nice relaxing day where I... <sighs> Went back to crash. We'll get the hang of it. I pro it probably would be a safer trip for me to be using the turtle shells to jump over these gaps like they intended. Um, I always have a hard time with that. I like. I mean, I'm 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 not having an easy time with the bridge ropes either. Don't get me wrong, but I don't know something about something about them shells. They feel like they're supposed to seem more helpful than what they are. You know what? We'll try it. We'll try it. I gotta at least try the shells. They gave me a pity mask. Cool. Okay. Yeah. I guess that's fine. Sort of. I guess I also got to make sure the turtles are very close to the edge, and I've also... <laughs> Boy, jeepers. Doing great. What a level to warm up on. Mm. I swear, someone just lathered those ropes in soap. Uh, they are slippery. They refuse to be landed on. But I'm gonna. I'm gonna. No! Oh my gosh. Oh my. <sighs> well, it is what it is. This is Crash. Death is it part of it. If you're, if you're looking to play Crash Bandicoot and you're not looking to die, or you don't enjoy uh, challenging a game that'll probably bring you to your death, you're playing the wrong game. Now if you miss, if you miss hearing that sweet siren call of death, if you truly wish to just feel like life is fleeting and uh, has just faint flicker of existence. Crash Bandicoot's your game. There we go. That one... Oh god, I forgot about that one. That one's so rude. I don't appreciate how the turtle doesn't break the boards, but a bandicoot would, as if a bandicoot is that much bigger than a turtle. I guess it depends on the... oh, right, rope. Probably should be using that. I guess it depends on the type of turtle, but 
I know bandicoots aren't aren't actually that big. Am I gonna get game over on this level? I am being way too reckless here. There we go. And I should have known. I, I should have known that I wouldn't have been able to make that jump. I just thought, wow, it's right there. And I did that again, too. Oh, come on. Okay. No! I shouldn't kill that turtle. That turtle is probably my best way over there, my safest way over there. I just, I don't trust the turtles. I think that's what it is. I feel like they're they're not just an enemy that I could potentially walk into. They're an enemy who's like, oh, hey, you're supposed to use this to get a better balance, but like, we might not work out for you and end up killing you anyways. Hook, <laughs> hook. Okay. I might actually get game over on this one, yikes. Okay. Checkpoint number two. Oh. Oh. Was expecting another turtle. And you aren't sitting on anything, Mr. Warthog Dog thing. Oh, yeah. No, I'm ready for it, you know. Yeah, I don't have to jump onto the rope for this stuff. This is just accuracy jumping there. Okay. Wow, nothing was gonna run at me at that one. Okay. Yeah, I feel like that first half of the level is way trickier. I don't know, maybe it wouldn't have been if I used the turtle shells. Okay. I, mm, this is it. This is the jump. This is the one that always makes me regret using the turtle shells. <sighs> Breathe. Relax. Okay! You know what? I almost had it though. I bet you if I just really lean into it, I could could make it. Come on. Okay. Yeah, definitely going in the bonus level. I could use some more lives. Uh, gonna get me some more of them sweet, sweet lives. Hmm. Not sure if I know the uh, the best strat for getting all of this. Oh, okay. But I'm still gonna go for at least most of it. I mean, they got the two lives at the end. That's kind of the real prize. But if I can get. Uh, enough of the boxes to like get a get a womp of fruit life. That could be some good stuff. Uh, okay. Oh boy, that was scary. Oh, it might be just enough to get another live out of that. Yeah, there we go. I hate the turtles and having to. Jump on them. Jump on it. Jump on it. Bam, 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 bam. Thank Christ. Not even concerned about boxes that were missed at all. 
but also besides the boxes at the checkpoint in the bonus level i don't think i remember seeing any so that actually i mean like surviving the level is a little tricky but getting the box crystal there isn't uh doesn't seem too too bad okay I should have grabbed the name of this level. I was trying to remember what this level was called earlier. But no, I didn't pay attention to it because I am a fool. This is one though where we've got more boxes to give us Swamp of Fruit. Um, I'm probably going to be able to survive a little bit longer in that previous level. So I think we can, I think we can start garnering a bit of a profit of lives, if you will, more gained than spent. Get your creepy hands out of here. Do you know grabbing at people through iron bars on the ground is wrong? Just ask Georgie. I guess there weren't any iron bar bars, but you know, you get it. Oh wow, I'm surprised I actually jumped down onto that platform, all right. I usually die there because I have such a bad time with timing drops. Jumps is one thing, but just dropping to land where I want to be at a certain time? Oh boy. Ooh, yeah. All right, we're making it. Uh, I guess that was end of the route over this way. Um, I think there's kind of an up ascent and then uh, going all the way over kind of just above where I started. I think that's all that there is to this. I don't know why I went on there. I should have known I wasn't, that staircase wasn't going to last. They got me. They got me with their their evil. Oh, that's right. There isn't a checkbox for miles in this one. I'm not having that. Okay. Bum, bam, 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 bam. Come on. Mm. Honestly, not going to go for those. I feel like I was lucky to have dropped down on the platform correctly the first time. I want to play it safe. I want to get to a checkbox. I'm fine if I didn't get an extra five Wampa Fruit. Hell yeah, alrighty. Now you slippery stairs, you. Yeah, that was much better timed. Ooh. I just gotta survive the rest and not fall because those stairs sure as heck will not, will not be forgiven. Okay, mm yeah, sounds about right. Why? Why did I? Why did I think that that platform would just be patient and wait for me? Um, nothing in this game is your friend. Honestly, not even the boxes in Wampa Fruit. Like, sure, the Wampa Fruit helps give you lives and the boxes gets you gems, but a lot of times they're in precarious places that, uh, that's that dropping tech again. Terrible at it. Even if it is just a step worth of a drop. Even if it is not even a drop. Um, but yeah, no, even the boxes can be put in like really sketchy places, and that makes me wonder are you even my friend? Are you even on my team?
Ooh, nope. Missed the time that. There we go. Alright. This is the time that I at least get to a checkbox. This is it. This is the one. This is it. I do appreciate how rude it feels to just jump on those birds. They kind of don't deserve it because they are like the least amount of an obstacle in this level compared to all the other obstacles. But details, details. Haha, <laughs> got you down there. Alrighty. This is it. This is where I pay attention to when I'm jumping and how quickly it's going. Okay, okay. We, we were given some mercy. Mercy we shouldn't have been given, but we were given it. Bird comes back. Cool. Gotta wait for that thing to be on the down low. Okay, whoa, right. We're making progress. That is... <sighs> That's a sketchy stairwell if I've ever seen one. Okay. boy that's it that's how it goes that's how we do and stairs that actually stay stairs i appreciate that not even gonna worry because my true prize is right there tasty zesty even oh that's right this thing's a it's got a weird form to it a weird rotation Okay, Ooh, that started zipping around way more than I expected. Oh, thank you for just having some normal stairs. That's all I need. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Cool. Come on, burb. Be that platform that I need. Lift me up, Buttercup. Oh. I'll take that line. Thank you. Maybe I'm even on track for the... Uh... Embryo stage. I, don't, I think I missed those two boxes down below there, so I don't think I'll be getting the box crystal, but... I might be on track for the embryo. We'll see. I don't actually remember where all those are. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely going to try that. Because if I can actually beat it, that's going to be some pretty nice lives. Wow, that was an attempt. Certainly was. Can't argue that that was not an attempt. You won't catch me calling it a good attempt. But I know what I must do for that first part. And then I get to the second part and we'll die. And then be like, oh, now I know what to do for the second part. But I can't get the first part down anymore. Hey, can I even make that jump? How am I supposed to handle that one? That seems tricky. Okay. That is how it is handled. Okay. Not a bad tactic. Gonna do the same thing I just did, expecting different results. So, definition of insanity. Except not exactly the same thing, because I'm gonna, gonna adjust my own timing. And do that at a better time. Like... Now! make it yes that's how we do 
And that's a profit. Because I'm pretty sure I came into this into this level with like 15 lives. Oh, do I want that one? Oh, I don't want to risk it. I'm so close. I can feel it in my jeans. Yeah, plus nice little buffet right here at the end to be like, hey, sorry, we're such a pain. All right, what's next? Is it that one where I get, to, it's like a straight shot through the lab, lights out? Ooh, lights out, okay. Uh, I really like the levels that, uh, like, the lighting becomes a thing and you gotta get the masks, or in the later ones, like, the little firefly. Um, I, yeah, I don't, like, I don't think it's specifically the lights out gimmick that appeals to me, but just how the levels tend to be shaped. Uh, I get a kick out of. I like how this goes. Oh no! I should have grabbed that live. <laughs> Jumping into the pit, that's fine, it happens. Missing that live. Sin. And I'll wait. Missed the live again. They do give you a lot of checkboxes in this one, I gotta say. Who says you need Assassin's Creed to leap of faith? Just play Crash and jump into darkness where you don't even know if something's gonna be coming for you, but you just have to trust that there will be a platform. Do I look like I have time to stop? Damn it. I am late for a very important meeting about box breaking. We were about to discuss how we could build more fragile boxes. Some very important investors meeting. A lot of them are going to be showing up. We need to look professional. No shirts, but shoes and pants mandatory. Oh, wow. Kind of grabbed a hold of the wall on that one. Oh, crap. Did that break the thing? I might lose my lights sooner than I want to. All the more reason for me to hurry up. There we go. Heck yeah. Wow, there's only 15 boxes in there and I missed three of them? All oh, right, the little green gem platform thing I don't have unlocked yet. Which you could see what those look like if you all want me to go through the gems. I will even go for the colored gems. Uh, despite the challenge that they can and are, can be and will be and are. Um, but yeah, you gotta let me know in the comments. You want me to go to Crash 2? You want me to play, go for the box crystals and like, 100% this one in that regards. You want you want to even see me do time trials? Maybe time trials and not the box one? Up to you. You guys just gotta let me know. Yeah, that's right. I know when the fire ends. I know when it's sketch and not sketch to jump.
uh, remember the last level of this style where I, it, it ended in that same exact setup and I, uh, you know, couldn't do it to save my life while talking. This is good. There's been improvement. See, that would have been fine. But the game did the whole, oh, you got hit but had invincibility. Here's a little extra jump. And I didn't want that extra jump. I was about to land where I wanted to. Jeez. I didn't want those apples anyways. <coughs> apples. Oh, god damn it. I want the fruit. That's what I get for calling them apples. The gods of this game know. If you ever wonder if momentum is important in a, in a platformer like this, most definitely. Okay, I wasn't sure where that actually had landed. Okay. We're fine. We'll make it. I know what to be concerned about going forward. I think it, mm, I probably should just assume if those little... If, there, if I have little columns like that there, then spikes are probably coming out of them. I don't think they have any of those that don't shoot out spikes. Oh, I guess that one there. Hey, you're just like the burbs. You're there to help me. Sort of. Oh, yeah. We need the blue gem for that one. Oh, hey, you're here to help. Man, who would have ever thought a video game could teach me how friendly spiders are? Son of a gun. I had my, my mask. Let me up. I don't need to go through the full animation of that. Hello? Okay. Wait, what? Did I? Did I miss how that works? Am I supposed to go on top of those there? That timing seemed a little bunk. I don't remember having to go up top, but, uh... Well, it's been a while since I've played this first game. Two is my favorite, so if we do go on to two... You're gonna, you're gonna see, you're gonna see a Cory who understands what they're doing just a little bit more. Because I've put more time into that one. Considerable amount more. I do I have to I'm gonna try jumping low. I don't think I can jump high enough to get over those. But I'm starting to wonder if that is the if that's the go-to metric. If that is like if this is supposed to be the level where I'm forced to learn that so that I know, oh hey, and by the way, if you had figured that out in the last level, it would have made that one easier too. But now you have to learn it. Similar to, like, the bridge. I think in the first bridge level they had a jump that... I think they had a jump where, like, it is way easier to make the jump jumping off of the turtle shell or whatever. Um, but you don't have to. Whereas in that second bridge level you have to use the turtle shell. So that that's kind of like a, hey, if you didn't know from before, you're gonna learn now. It also might make your time at that other level a little nicer. Which is cool. I mean, in a, in a in a 
platforming game here where you aren't actually like unlocking new skills or movement tech. You just kind of are forced to learn it. Okay, that's how I get through that brief little... There we go. It's, uh... Something I really like about The Witness, actually. Sort of. I mean, there, there's not like movement tech or upgrades or what have you, but... Like, you can kind of just go to whatever puzzle on that island that you want, and... Um, you know, if you if you are figuring things out at other parts of the island, it may come easier to you than... Oh, uh, oh. Uh. Do I want to, though? Not really. Kind of just want to go through this level. But I have no doubt in my mind that there are, similar to the first version of this level, invisible bricks or boxes that I can stand on to get more stuff. In fact, probably another Cortex thingy. Again, not... When was my last checkbox? Thank Christ. <laughs> the peak of relaxation. This game. Yeah, I'm just going to be annoyingly patient with it. Because I don't want to risk being dumb. get through. Oh, hey, there it is. Giving us the bonus level right at the end. Interesting, interesting choice. I didn't think I was going to make that. I was going really slow, but uh, didn't hurt to give it a shot, I guess. I'm just going to do it this way a little bit faster. There we go. Don't even care if there's a life at the top of that stack. Oh my god, there was, and that not rushing for it paid off. I appreciate that game. For as many times as you make me feel like I just need to keep moving forward and that I can't stop, it's really nice that you'd give it to me there. Towards the end of the game. Okay, I gotta keep an eye on the first one. Second one. Third one. Okay, so it is just kind of a tunnel. There we go. Alright. Yeah, I was thinking about making this episode, I don't know, 45 minutes-ish, so... 10 minutes? Probably got time for one more. We're averaging about 11 minutes in uh, a level here. Wow. I know I missed a lot, but... I didn't realize it would be that that intense for all the ones that I missed. Okay, is this the level that I wanted to do? Castle machinery? It sounds like it. No, it's not. If I get the green gem, I can literally just go up and around and it takes me to the end of the level right away. But I can't do that because I don't have the green gem. Right. Those. Those are a different thing. Eh. I shouldn't have thought that I could make that. But, so, you know, part of this game is about the exploration. What can I do? And what can't I? And uh, jumping stealthily in between those like that so that I don't have to stop is not something I can pull off. 
what that is. Mm, yeah, I don't like don't like you doing that. It's okay, I always feel like I'm in a hurry, so I'll be getting off the platform right away anyways, but I don't like that it's there. Well, thank you, Mask. You're always there for me. Except when you aren't, but that's not your fault. That's because you were there for me and then I used you up. Oh my god. Thank you for being a platform for me. Oh, this. Just as fruit. Can I go up there? No? Okay. Oh, no! I saw it, but I was too late to do anything about it. I didn't recognize it until I had touched it. Mmm, was just about to spin him, and then I realized. Then I realized. Oh, wait, when did I... When did I go... When did I make use of the two and a half D... Uh, when did I forget that it does that? Okay, okay, okay. I know I shouldn't be in shouldn't be too much of a maniac to get all of those if I really want to make it through this level, but I also want them. You know what? No. We're just gonna do it this way. There we go. My turf. It's probably a faster way through there, but that's. Oh! Thought it was gonna go up. All of that work just to move about, I don't know, 10 meters? Oh, dang, and I would, if I had focused on getting those boxes down there, I actually would have had the box crystal. Son of a gun. Well, you know what? Let's end this one off with a boss fat battle. Dr. Nitrous Brio, or Dr. Embryo. The, uh, yes, master of this, of this series. Do I remember exactly how this goes? No. But I think I remember something about jumping on those. Yeah, okay, jumping on those does damage to him. Okay. Yeah, the purple one I know is, uh... Yep, that's what that is. Okay, come on. Come on. <gasps> Damn it. Uh, he always gets me with the purple. I'm never expecting it. I'm like, where are you going to throw the green? Where do I got to jump to next? You never respect that uh, that I don't want him to use the purple because the purple's scary. But here comes the purple, and then two greens. Give me those greens. 
And then you're going to do a probably two purples, maybe even three to just really throw me off my game. Yeah, that was three purples. I saw. Oh my gosh. Feel like a dumb. Feel like a dumb dumb for that one. Come on, Embryo. What you got? What you got? A purple? I was expecting it. Just like I was expecting these two greens. Come on. Give me those three purples you know I hate. Okay, that was actually really close. Come on, come on. Oh? I don't know what I did there. I mean, I guess I, I was too close to him. I don't know. I've seen something where, like, when he, he, he's he got a form where he, like, turns into a, a Hulk in this boss fight here. And I've seen that you can actually, um, like, when he's transforming, you can get on top of his head and just be up there to, to bounce on his head. Um, and it's actually, it looks like it's kind of hard to even get off from above him. God dang. Um, but I've never actually done it myself, so I'm going to give it a shot here, because it's fun, it makes that part of the boss fight super easy. Um, yeah, we'll see. I don't know, maybe i got to, like, wait to jump until after he does his little clank, clank, clash things together. Or maybe i got to deplete his health bar before the Hulk thing happens. I don't exactly remember. Okay, maybe I do gotta deplete the health bar a little. Come on! Get up there! No! How did they do it? I wanna know! Can you show me? I wanna know. Oh, right, purple. Jesus, that almost got me again. Okay. When his head starts to swell when he does the transform, that's like right before it happens. I wonder if I've got to jump just right at that. Because I'd imagine... Currently, they've got some sort of invisible wall keeping me from jumping on his head. But that's how you're supposed to defeat the Hulk one. So there's got to be a frame where that wall goes away. And I probably have to jump at or on him, like, right at that frame. That's probably how it's done. Oh, God. That's... I can't keep track of which one. Ah, jeepers. Why is that why is that so much trouble? Like it it totally doesn't look like it should be. It doesn't seem like a difficult thing. Is it just because it's a small space and I didn't have a mask and I was just unfamiliar? I don't know. Those seem I feel, I feel embarrassed to be having trouble with the slimes, I guess is what I'm trying to get across. They don't seem like they should be this much of a trick. There we go! Okay, go. Go. Oh, 
Okay, well, there goes my mask. And I was really counting on that for this final part. Drink it up. Okay, nope. Didn't work. There. Okay. Come at me. Dang it! So close! It was my my own foolish behaviors that were my downfall. Well, I've got the mask. And Hulk didn't uh Hulk didn't surprise me as much as I thought I would he would. He just moved he, he just threw the slow ball at that last one, and that's why I jumped too soon. Made me think I had to I had less time to react. One, two, three. Wow. How did I? I did, but I didn't. Right, throw your bananas amount of potions and... See, that didn't even blow up. So I guess I'm to assume that if it's thrown at me, it'll shatter like that. But that, I'm sorry. I'd sooner believe the physics of that being that the bottle would just bounce off of me, not break onto me. And then, and also, there was no light to show that it broke. It didn't explode midair. I don't know. I'm questioning your uh, your science here, Embryo. I'm questioning your 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 alchemic ability. Okay, feel like that was just about exactly the same thing I did last time, except this time I didn't lose the mask. Not gonna argue, not gonna complain. Doesn't make sense to me. Boom. All right. There's that. Okay, and now, you're gonna come forward, and I'm gonna be like, oh, that was a slow ball, but no worry. Oh, oh boy. Okay, I gotta be really careful with this last one. I don't want a repeat of a mess up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No! What? 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 Whatever, they gave me two masks now out of pity because I'm terrible at this game and I shouldn't be playing it. I just wanted to relax. I just wanted this to be chill. Okay, embryo. Nitrous brio. I have to wonder. Oh wait, shoot. My wondering totally just messed that up for me. Okay, uh, have to wonder. Who named him Nitrous? Is that a self-made name? Or is there a mother out there who's like, yo, Nitrous is kind of a lit name. Was he made in a lab? Is that why? I mean, I guess he's got a Frankenstein vibe. I just, I'd assume at some point he was human. Oh, that first brick is closer. It might, he might not actually be going any slower. I just have to wait a little bit longer. And I clearly have to wait a little bit longer. Jesus. He's just so widespread. I'm nervous that he's going to reach me before I initiate my jump. I can do that more confidently if I don't just waste both of my pity masks thinking about why he's named Nitrous. Oh, right, purple. That's still not in my head very clearly. Okay. That's right. I got the hang of that now. 
I'm gonna give it a shot. No, I'm not. It's gotta be right on the, like the frame of transformation. That's where it's gotta be. Wow, I screwed that up. Like when his character model switches out from normal to big and green, that's gotta be right when you gotta jump onto his head. There it is. Yeah, you fall out the window. Well, took longer than I was expecting. Oh, the lab. Yeah, that was the one. That's that's a level I like, and we'll we'll get into that next time, I guess. Um, but yeah, thanks for joining us. Hope you enjoyed the the few levels and the the, the video itself and uh, make sure to comment. Let me know what you want to see next for this, uh, be it the second Crash game, if you want me to just move on to that after I beat this one, if you want to see me going through time trials or box gems, uh, just let me know. Otherwise, uh, if I do go to the second game, I guarantee I'm sticking with that one until it's... Uh, I'm going to stick with it for a while. Um, I'm not going to just end after the last level that one i enjoy playing too much not to go back and get some of the other gems and time crystals and stuff um not to mention too it gets once you beat i think it's once you beat the boss in the second one you in the new trilogy you get the speed up so that helps with the time crystals um if i'm not mistaken on that but anyways i'm rambling have a good one everybody bye